set app family, take a look at your desktop. How many icons do you see? One, 10, a few dozen? When was the last time you spent five minutes just locating the exact screenshot or downloaded file you needed there? Even if we dedicate a few minutes every week or day to cleaning up the clutter that gathers on our desktop, we still somehow end up with a bunch of files on it. And just when we have the biggest mess, a meeting, call, or a quick screenshot urgently require a pristine background. Here's how to hide icons on your Mac desktop. First, let's see how we can easily hide icons on the desktop of your Mac for a screen sharing session. Plim Pro is designed for this specific task. Just toggle the switch to presentation mode from the app's menu bar icon dropdown menu, and your desktop icons are gone. More, the app also disables notifications, hides active apps, mute speakers, and can even change your wallpaper. You can adjust these settings as needed. With the app, you can also easily mute yourself from the touch bar or with a custom shortcut. Now, what if you're taking a screenshot? Use CleanShot X. Not only does the app have extensive screenshotting functionality, scrolling screenshots, self-timed screenshots, text capture, and much more, the app also has a quick hide desktop icons menu option in its menu bar drop-down menu. To remove icons from the desktop of your Mac, click the CleanShot icon in your menu bar and select Hide Desktop Icons. To revert your Mac OS action to hide desktop icons, click Show Desktop Icons. If you want a one-stop controller for your Mac OS, not just to hide desktop icons, but quickly switch between other Mac settings, like turning on dark mode or a screensaver, hide dock or mute your mic, one switch is what you need. Here's how to hide desktop icons on Mac with the app. Click the menu bar for one switch and toggle the switch next to hide desktop icons. If you are taking a screenshot or sharing your screen, hiding your dock can also be handy. Add the switch by clicking customize and then checking the box next to hide dock. Now your screen is ready for the spotlight. Oh, and by the way, in one switch, you can also customize keyboard shortcuts for each action in the app for near instant customization of your Mac. And if you are an even more advanced Mac tweaker, Almighty is the magical tool you want. The app desktop and finder to system settings and even Xcode. This tiny, just 19 megabytes app is truly almighty. Here's how to hide folders and files on your Mac desktop with Almighty. Click the app icon in the menu bar and scroll down to find show desktop icons. Toggle the switch and the icons are removed. You can also choose between a number of other settings you can adjust on your Mac with the app. From cursor visualization to scheduled shutdowns, this tiny but mighty app can help you customize your Mac experience very easily. Just like the rest of the apps in the video, you can find Almighty on SetApp, a subscription for productivity tools for your Mac and iPhone. If you aren't on SetApp yet, try the service with a seven day free trial. And if you are, go get the apps on SetApp right now. Try them out and let us know in the comments which one was the most useful to you. If you found our video on how to remove icons from the desktop of your Mac useful, please hit the like button, save this video to a playlist, and subscribe for more. Thank you for watching, and we are looking forward to seeing you on our other videos with helpful tips and ideas for your Mac.